he grabs me in a headlock, I'm standing. First thing is, he's not gonna choke me from this position, okay? He can squeeze all he wants, but he doesn't really have the front of my neck, he's not squeezing my, my carotids. So I'm not super worried about the choke. What I'm worried about is him punching me with this hand, right? He's gonna be, that's a threat for me. So I need to get a hold of that wrist, and I'm reaching behind his body and grabbing around and in front of that arm here. So now I have two of my hands on one of his hands, okay? Now, he can squeeze in all that he wants, okay? With my legs now, I'm gonna take and put this foot behind his farthest foot, all right? Now, as a friendly thing, I'm gonna let go of his arm just so he can break fall, okay? So I hang on here, but normally I would just hang onto this and fall that way, okay? But since he's my friend, I'm gonna let go of his arm, stick this foot here, and I'm gonna turn towards my side here. Not, I'm not gonna pull him on top of me, I need to pull towards the side. So this foot here, and now I just lay back. Now, from this position, okay, I want him to hang on to me because it's more realistic. He's gonna hang on here, all right? I'm gonna put my forearm on his face. Now, they used to teach us to break away like this, but it never works for me. So what I do is I'm gonna put my forearm, and now I put my knee, and now I hold his head down. And now I take my head towards his hips, and I can usually get out, and now I have a control position. Okay, so that's that one. protection from mount is he's gonna be trying to punch I don't want to sit here and like this is where he's aiming right boom or especially like my head up now I get the, the rebound punch so as soon as I feel like this is the position I need to keep my body busy and I don't want to just bump once and then hang out and let him reset I need to stay busy as soon as his hands touch okay as soon as I feel like that happens I need to capture one so I bump okay and I'm gonna swim and I'll show this side since you're here and I trap that arm Okay, now I always want the inside grip. I always want inside, okay? I never want to be grabbing like this because he can still elbow and punch me. So I'm inside all the way and I capture. This one stays inside because he's still gonna be trying to punch me with that one. As soon as that happens, I'm gonna stay here, trap this foot and bump up over this shoulder. Now, as a good training partner, I wanna make sure that he protects his arm, right? And grabs my wrist or something like this. I mean, my shoulder. I don't want his hand flat on the floor because if I roll him that way, it's gonna hurt his wrist. So I'm gonna let him capture, and now I'm gonna bump up and over, and now I can disengage and run away, okay? So that's a, a first one from mount. The other one would be from guard. Okay, we start here from guard. He goes to punch me again. I don't wanna leave this distance where he's aiming. So as soon as I feel like that's happening, I'm gonna pull with my legs, okay? Pull with my legs. Get my arms inside, okay? And I'm gonna capture his arm. I, I wanna stay inside. If I can capture one, that's great, okay? And I get his head. And now, from this position, I don't wanna stay here. He's still gonna be trying to punch me. What I, how I like to do it is I like my forearm on his bicep and my hand cupped behind his tricep, okay? I don't wanna try and grab here because he'll just rip it backwards and punch anyway, okay? So here and here, he's gonna give me a lot more forward backward control, and then I follow him with my elbow. So if he tries to swim inside, right, I need to follow that, that elbow, okay? So I'm gonna keep him close. Once he gets frustrated with this, he's gonna end up typically backing up. I put my feet on his hips, and again, I want the inside position. My hips are off the floor. If he stands up, it's the same thing, right? I want my hips off the floor. I can up kick, create space. But this is, this is where I'm gonna be. As soon as, if I can get to this position, he decides to give me space enough, Right? I don't want you to get up 
into here, he'll still kick and punch me, okay? So if I get enough space with whatever, now I can create space here. I want my head to stay backward, okay? This way, all right? So I do the technical stand up from there to get away from me, all right? 